Welcome to Gearbox. Uh, live audio, KRA Blue Line made in Italy. Yep, Jim. this is something you can relate to, Julius. Extremely it's, much so. It's an audio device. Once again, I'll uh, expand on my dislike of plastic speaker boxes on tripod stands. Why use those at a corporate gig when you can use something like this, which is much more elegant and aesthetic? Now, we, we've obviously condensed the space between the high and the low element Because here. we took the pole out. We took the pole out. <coughs> um, that's just for convenience sake. The pole actually screws into the top of the sub. Yep. The sub's a single 12, Julius. And Sealed the, enclosure. Yep. And the, the mid-high is eight three-inch drivers. Mm. In testing, uh, I discerned that the vertical dispersion is pretty much line of sight like that. Uh, however, it goes quite wide, I'd guess 160 degrees wide. Yeah, that sounds reasonable So we walked know. around, very useful. Yeah, look, um, the, this is, <clears throat> the idea of this, uh, what we've talked about so far is all speaker elements, but what we haven't talked about is the back panel. And the back panel's got a four input digital mixer on board, and whilst there's not a lot of control there, basically you can control level and the amount that each of the first two channels sends into the internal effects engine, um, inputs three and four, no controls over really. Um, ah, but USB, so yes. hook up the laptop. Yeah, you hook up the laptop and run the uh, run the software, and that gives you a whole host of stuff. Um, there's level, there's parametric EQ, there's compressors for the channels. Is there control over input three and four that don't have a gain? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, oh, it's okay. digital mixer. Well, that's useful. Now, the huge... what kind of software is it? Is like it's PC and Mac, yeah. Yeah, and it's PC only, which is <laughs> like. <laughs> There's a little bag that oh. you put over the sub and only all the cables. Would, only you would get excited about it. All the cables go in the back. Case. Um And this is kind of cool too. There's these little adapter things. So you can actually stick those onto the top yeah. and use it as a oh, wedge. That's a good plan. Yeah, that's a really cool thing. That's very um, good. I like that. So look, this is designed. This is designed for, for someone like a musician to be able to plug it in, you know, at a gig. You know, build, building the whole thing is very simple. You plug the IEC plug in. power lead yeah. in. You plug in one speak on lead between the sub and the um, you can and plug the in And there's there's only one place it plugs in. Yeah, and you it's can, got a slave out so we can set up a second one if yeah, we want to run can, dual you can actually, mono. You can run stereo. Um, How? There's uh, there is options for configuration. Oh, okay. In um, in the aforementioned PC and the software, aforementioned PC software, yes. which involves a trip to Windows, which does. Um, but that said, you know the idea is that blue screen you can, of death. <laughs> you can come along. You can plug in your iPod if you're if you're some some folks with a guitar or something. You've got an iPod with some backing tracks. You plug your iPod in. You plug your guitar in. You plug in a couple of mics. Some um, person with a guitar. It's, it's, some it's person a, with a guitar. Sp swag. 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 Um, doesn't quite sound right. It doesn't. But anyway, the idea of this is it's going to work really nicely in little places mm. like like little clubs or corner of a restaurant yep, for yep. the acoustic duo. Um, or the for, retail like price. I said before, corporate gigs. Yeah, corporate gigs. Um, the nice thing there is is the pattern control and, mm. and obviously as you address the, the visual city. the visual elements. Absolutely. Element, it, it's a really good looking little system. And it feels it feels bomber. It, it feels really it well made. It feels well made. It's made in Italy. Yeah. Look out of the box, I think the, the bottom end on it's a little bit sort of woolly, but I don't um, know about that. I mean we we gave it a caning a few minutes ago. We, we did. We were dancing, we had disco music. We did, we did. Um look I I think you'd you'd want to get in and put some roll offs on your um on your vocal mics and mm. so on, but look, even straight out of the box, it's still, it's very usable. Mm. It's got a multi-effector um, with how many? It's eight or 10 or 12. It's... There's, there's like a rotary. Six, so the effector effect. is always on. It's just a question of whether you send to it. From it's the very, very simple. Um, yeah, we it's, found it's some... designed so musicians can use yeah. it. And that's not saying musicians that's not an are insult. simple. I'm saying it's hassle-free. It, the creativity of musicians is you can be renowned. you can be free to spend we, more time creating and less time need, worrying about your we sound. need musicians if we don't have musicians we, we don't, don't have, have a music. gig mate yeah <laughs> no but um well if if we start giving them all these then maybe we don't have a gig anyway but well, we don't deserve a gig there is that but look it's um it's the KRA Blue Line KB one system yeah. and nice and for what it is it's it's not the cheapest system around but I think um, if you're doing a lot of small size gigs as a professional muso, uh, I think this is a great choice. Yeah, and um, for driveway rental, I'd definitely whack a few of these in. Very mm. simple.
That's it. That's it.